and I get rewarded by a mushroom. Usually these flowers are in full bloom by now. It's going to be a late season this year. There's so many people out here picking this area anymore. If you want to find any mushrooms, you're probably going to have to get off the trail. Not really expecting to find much out here today. Whatever I do find will probably be pretty small. have some hound's tongue just starting to bloom. Spring is here. It is getting pretty windy up here. Now where I'm hiking right now we are under a winter storm warning. That means you better dress in layered clothing. I have my shirt I have another shirt and my rain and jacket. Boots that have good traction when you're out here. Don't forget your hat. Just a couple of days ago, this was all under snow, and it will all be under snow again, maybe tonight, if not tomorrow night for sure. Due to the seasonal and unpredictable nature of nature, I do not post my videos on a regular schedule like everyone else does. I will be posting seasonally for sure. During morel seasons I will post morels. During chanterelle seasons I will be posting chanterelles or whatever else is in season. I do try to get out at least once a week but it may take me a couple weeks to get enough content to make a decent video. I do enjoy walking this trail. This is one of my springtime places that I like to go. But I never find mushrooms actually on the trail. Once I get to where I know there's a patch, I will go off the trail and head up the hill. Now, I like to use a Venza Maps on my phone for marking my patches. Oh, I'm sure glad I brought my boots today. This, is, this would be slick and slippery otherwise. This is poison oak. You really don't want to grab any of this when you're heading up the hill. Don't do this. <laughs> I very rarely get poison oak. I'm probably immune to it. I've had it so many times. I was sitting at home watching this grapple come down thinking, I really don't want to go out in this weather. However, now that I'm up here, I'm sure glad I did. Actually, the wet weather makes this hill a lot easier to climb because my boots grip a lot better, believe it or not. Last year it was so dry, walking up this was like walking on a hill covered in ball bearings. And I get rewarded by a mushroom. I always pinch them off and leave the stem in the ground. The way the weather's been, I really haven't been expecting to see anything up here today. Oh, it may be cold out, but you still need to check your pant legs for ticks every now and then. Ah, 
I see somebody left their gloves up in the tree. Well, I guess their loss is my gain. For some reason, I'm always finding gloves out in the woods. I wonder why that is. That is just in time, too. My hands were starting to get a little cold. Looks like it's trying to snow. More of a sleep or a grapple, I guess. Well, there's a few snowflakes zigzagging down. Sure glad I brought my hat. Well, there's today's pick sitting on the hood of my car. I have changed the name of my channel from Applegate Bushcraft Survival and Prospecting to something a little shorter. Applegate Outdoors Adventures, which is probably more of an accurate title for this channel since that's pretty much what I do. It still includes bushcraft and everything else, but we'll go with this title and see how it does. Well, this is Phil with Applegate Outdoors Adventures. Thank you for watching. Please be sure to hit the thumbs up button and have a good one.